now the measurement of an earthquake and how do we measure the intensity of earthquake the tremors which are produced inside the earth they are measured by an instrument which is called a seismograph seismograph is called seismo because it is derived from the word seismic seismic is the word which is related to the earth and so in the device in the seismograph there is a pendulum which is hanging it it shows a pendulum now this pendulum is attached to a pen and this pen is hanging freely so what happens there is a machine shown here which is actually rotating in this picture there is a roller shown this roller keeps on rotating when it rotates the pendulum ink or the pen is touching the roller so if there is no earthquake then the roller will keep on moving and it will show a single line without any bend but when earthquake is caused so here it shows there symbolically that when there is an earthquake then this the area which is situated under this will start vibrating it will vibrate to left and to right and therefore this seismograph will also start shaking as a result the pendulum which is situated at the top will start shaking and it will show a reading earlier the reading was straight now the reading will become zigzag the reading will become more curved why does it become curved because the pendulum which has been shown it will start moving when the pendulum will move the pen will also shake when the pen will shake then the reading which is shown on the seismograph will not be a straight line so this shows that there was an earthquake the more there is intensity the curve will also not be straight and here in this next the colored picture you can see there is a vibration shown epicenter is the word shown the place which is situated where the earthquake is generated inside the earth the place where the vibration starts that is the area where the plates hit that is called the focus seismic focus and from this vibrations are there these vibrations spread out just like when you throw a stone inside water there are waves caused in the water ripples are caused these ripples move in circular path and they spread out and these vibrations travel outwards and then they their intensity becomes lesser so where the place the place where the vibration start that is called the focus and from there the vibrations travel in different directions the place which is situated directly above the focus that is the epicenter there the intensity of earthquake is higher so the place which is directly situated above here the intensity will be more and the places which are situated on the other side their intensity will be less because they are far away